we've got a bunch of new laws in California, new statutes that we need to deal with. He needs to tighten their seatbelts because it's going to be a bumpy ride. How many people have heard about the, the new union poster that you got to put up? Okay. It was originally passed back in August of last year, and it was supposed to go into effect in November. It applies to all private employers, regardless of whether you're unionized or not. And it, what it does is it advises employees of their rights to unionize and outlines how you as the employer can do uh, what you, you do certain things that's unlawful and that they have a remedy and that they should call somebody at the NLRB. But as of now, everyone should plan to have a poster in place as of April 30th of 2012. People's lives are on their smartphones. And smartphones, to the extent that you're an employer and you're giving them your employees smartphones, who controls all that private data that's in those smartphones? If you give your people smartphones and they're checking their phones all the time, are they working? And are you supposed to be paying them overtime? And that's a legitimate question, and you need to think about it. And if people are checking their emails when they're away from the office because you give them a smartphone, the answer is they're probably working. And if they're, if they're not exempt employees, you may be owing them overtime. If you give your employee a smartphone and then you call them from work while they're driving and they answer the phone, <laughs> are you responsible for them answering the phone because it's a work-related call on your smartphone while they're driving and they're not supposed to be answering the phone anyway? So there's a bunch of issues involved with that and you really think about it and, and I guess the bottom line, I'm not trying to scare you, I'm just trying to say you really need to think about it and you need to have really good policies. You need to think about what your policies are and not just assume, oh, I got a policy that I did 10 years ago and assume that it still works today. In a recent survey, 79% of employees said they use social media at work for business reasons. 82% said they use social media at work for personal reasons. 37% get this, said they rarely or never consider what their boss thinks about what they're putting on a social media site. And 34% said they rarely or never consider what their clients, what the company's clients think when they put something on a social media site. So obviously there's a tension. There's a tension between the employees, the, the employee's duty of loyalty to the employer, and then the employee's right of privacy and the employer's inability to discipline the employee for things that happen during non-work hours.